Okay gang, so when I look at this one, since it just has one variable, this is strictly chain. This is strictly chain with three layers. Let me just rewrite it in case anybody needs to see it from a different perspective. Okay, so remember if the two is on the trig, that's the same thing as saying you have two of these functions, these trig functions. All right, so again, since I only have one variable, there's no product, there's no quotient, this is strictly chain. This has three layers. This is the outermost layer. This is the middle layer. And this is the innermost layer. So when you see me do the chain rule, I'll do this first then this guy, and then this guy. All right, let's give it a go. Strictly chain rule. Derivative of one layer, keeping everybody else the same. All right, so now we're going to use a power rule. Bring the two down in front, multiply it times one fourth. That's going to give me one half. Keep everybody else the same. This becomes a one, and since it becomes a one, I don't write it, because that looks too similar to prime. So this is the derivative of the first layer. Now, I'm going to cross it out because in your head you really have to like be like, okay, that's gone. I've done that, right? So now you're taking the derivative of this. So now this is the next layer. So derivative of sine is cosine, keeping everything else the same. So that's the derivative of the middle layer. So now this guy's gone. Now you're going to take the derivative of this guy. Derivative of 2 theta is 2. All right, so now they're all gone. We've done them all. We've done each layer. Remember not to alter the trig unless you're using some kind of identity. Alright, so the 1 half times the 2 is going to go to a 1, so it's sine 2 theta, cosine 2 theta. I'm fine with that answer. If you guys went ahead and did the double angle, that's nice. Um, if you give it a try on the test and you're not sure, and you somehow screw up using the identity, I won't mark that wrong. I'll just grade it up to here. But if you want to give it a try, it'd be nice to see it on the test if you, if you feel comfortable enough. But yeah, you could use a double angle and go ahead and squeeze this to a different form. But this is good enough, gang, right here. All right, catch you. Bye-bye.